Have you ever wondered what it's like to travel in Portugal? Imagine a land where golden sunsets kiss endless coastlines, ancient castles stand tall amidst rolling hills, and the scent of freshly baked pastéis de nata fills the air. Welcome to Portugal, a gem nestled on the Iberian Peninsula. Let's start with a quick geography lesson. Portugal, the westernmost country of mainland Europe, is bordered by the Atlantic Ocean to the west and south, and by Spain to the north and east. The diverse geography of Portugal spans from the verdant mountains and vineyards of the north, through the rolling plains of the central region, to the rugged coastline of the Algarve in the south. Now, let's take a virtual stroll through the country's major cities. Imagine the hustle and bustle of Lisbon, Portugal's vibrant capital. Picture the narrow, winding streets of the Alfama district, the iconic pastel-colored buildings, and the trams clattering up steep hills, offering panoramic views of the city and the Tagus River. Then there's Porto, the city that gave the world port wine. Here, the Douro River sparkles under the sun, Ribeira District charms with its multicolored houses, and historic bridges like the Dom Luis Bus Bridge connect the city's two sides. Further south, we find Faro, the gateway to the Algarve region. Faro enchants with its well-preserved medieval quarters, vibrant nightlife, and proximity to idyllic beaches. And let's not forget about the regions. The Algarve, known for its breathtaking cliffs and golden beaches, is a sun-seeker's paradise. The Douro Valley, on the other hand, is a haven for wine lovers, with its terraced vineyards and grand quintas. So, whether you're a history buff, a foodie, a beachcomber, or an adventurer, Portugal has something for everyone. From the sun-drenched beaches of the Algarve, to the wine-soaked hills of the Douro Valley, from the bustling streets of Lisbon to the historic charm of Porto, Portugal offers a rich tapestry of experiences waiting to be discovered. But Portugal is not just a place, it's a feeling. Let's dive into the Portuguese culture next. A culture in Portugal is a colorful tapestry woven with threads from Africa, Asia, and Europe. The richness and diversity of Portuguese culture are its greatest treasures reflecting a deep-rooted history of influences from various continents. Let's dive deeper into this fascinating culture, starting with the soulful sounds of Fado music. Fado, an integral part of Portuguese culture, is a beautiful melancholic genre of music that tells stories of the sea, love, and loss. The haunting melodies and poignant lyrics will touch your heart, making you feel the emotions the singers pour into their performances. It's more than just music, it's the voice of the Portuguese soul, echoing through the narrow, winding streets of Lisbon and Porto. But the Portuguese culture isn't just about melancholic tunes, it's also about vibrant traditional folk dances that vary from region to region. From the lively Vira in Minho to the dramatic Coradinho in Algarve, these dances are a celebration of life, community, and tradition. They're often performed at festivals and celebrations, which are in themselves an essential part of Portuguese culture. In Portugal, family ties run deep. The Portuguese place a high value on family, often gathering for meals, celebrations, and even casual visits. Family is the cornerstone of social structure here, reflecting the warmth and closeness of the Portuguese people. Festivals and traditions also play a significant role in Portuguese life. Whether it's the colorful carnival with its lively parades and ornate costumes, or the Festa de São João in Porto, where the night sky lights up with lanterns and fireworks, these events are a testament to the Portuguese love for celebration. And let's not forget the Romerias, the religious pilgrimages that take place throughout the year. These are a blend of devotion and festivity, with processions, music and dancing, encapsulating the Portuguese spirit of joy and faith. And what better way to understand a culture than through its food? Let's move on to the delightful Portuguese cuisine. The Portuguese cuisine is a feast of unique flavors, where the sea meets the land. Imagine a country where the ocean's bounty meets the Earth's richness, where centuries-old culinary traditions merge with innovative gastronomy. Welcome to the world of Portuguese cuisine. A culinary journey through Portugal is incomplete without the iconic bacalhau, a dish made from salted codfish. Revered as a national dish, bacalhau showcases Portugal's deep connection with the sea. The cod is dried, salted, and can be cooked in innumerable ways. From being baked with potatoes and onions in bacalhau abras, to being combined with cream and eggs in bacalhau cum natas. It's a testament to the Portuguese saying that there are more than a thousand ways to cook bacalhau. But it's not just about seafood. Portugal's culinary scene is also a paradise for sweet tooths, thanks to pasteias de nata. 
These custard tarts are a Portuguese staple, with their crispy, flaky pastry holding a creamy, sweet custard filling. Topped with a sprinkle of cinnamon, these tarts are a delightful blend of texture and flavor, making them a favorite among locals and tourists alike. As we journey from the capital city to the regions, each place offers its own culinary gems. In Porto, the Francesinha reigns supreme. This sandwich is a meat lover's dream, layered with ham, sausage and steak, covered in melted cheese, and doused with a rich tomato and beer sauce. It's a hearty dish, perfect for those seeking comfort food. Down in the Algarve, the Cataplana takes center stage. Named after the clamshell-shaped copper pan it's cooked in, Cataplana is a seafood stew that combines a variety of seafood with flavors of garlic, onion, and tomatoes. It's a reflection of the region's abundant marine life and the Portuguese love for fresh, simple ingredients. Portuguese cuisine is a delightful dance of flavors. From the salty tang of bacalhau, the sweet creaminess of pastéis de nata, the robust heartiness of francesinha, to the fresh burst of cataplana, each dish tells a story, a tale of Portugal's history, its regions, and its people. Now that your taste buds are tingling, let's explore some of the must-see sites in Portugal. Portugal is a treasure trove of historical landmarks and breathtaking sites. Let's embark on a virtual tour, starting in the enthralling capital, Lisbon. Here, the Bellum Tower stands guard at the mouth of the Tagus River, a testament to Portugal's age of discovery. Not far away, the Geronimo's Monastery, a masterpiece of Manueline architecture, whispers tales of maritime expeditions. Venture uphill to the São Jorge Castle that offers panoramic views of the city, and lose yourself in the labyrinthine alleys of the Alfama district, the heart of Fado music. Don't forget to check out the LX Factory, a vibrant cultural hub nestled within a sprawling industrial complex. Next, we journey north to Porto, the city of bridges and port wine. The Ribeira district, with its colorful houses huddled along the Douro River, is a sight to behold. Here, the iconic Dom Luís de Vos Bridge connects the two halves of the city in a grand arch of iron and elegance. And for bibliophiles, Livraria Lello, with its magnificent neo-Gothic interiors, is considered one of the most beautiful bookstores in the world. Finally, we head to the fairy tale town of Sintra. The Pina Palace, perched atop a hill, is a whimsical blend of architectural styles, its brightly colored towers set against a backdrop of lush greenery. Venture into Quinta da Regalera, an enchanting estate with mystical gardens, hidden tunnels, and an iconic well spiraling into the earth. Each of these landmarks is steeped in history, their stories interwoven with the fabric of Portugal's rich cultural tapestry. They are more than just sights to be seen, they are experiences, waiting to unveil their secrets to those who seek them. While these landmarks are spectacular, there are also other top tourist destinations that deserve your attention. Portugal holds a world of wonders beyond its cities. Let's start our journey with the Douro Valley. This enchanting region is a paradise for wine lovers, boasting terraced vineyards that climb up steep hillsides and wine estates known as quintas. These quintas not only produce the famous port wine but also offer tastings and tours, allowing you to delve into the rich history of winemaking. The picturesque landscape of the Douro Valley, with its meandering river and undulating hills, is truly a sight to behold. Moving southward, we find ourselves in the Algarve, renowned for its breathtaking beaches and dramatic cliffs. This region is a haven for sunseekers, water sports enthusiasts, and nature lovers. The Algarve's coastline is dotted with quaint coastal towns, each offering its own unique charm. From the dramatic sea caves of Beneguil to the golden sands of Praia da Marinha, the Algarve's beaches are considered among the most beautiful in Europe. But wait, there's more! If you're a history buff, the city of Evora is a must-visit. As a UNESCO World Heritage Site, Evora is a living testament to Portugal's rich history. Within its medieval walls, you'll find well-preserved Roman ruins, including the iconic Roman temple and a labyrinth of narrow streets leading to a majestic cathedral. The city's historical center is a journey through time, showcasing architectural styles from the Roman, Gothic, and Manueline periods. From the rolling vineyards of the Douro Valley to the sun-kissed beaches of the Algarve and the historical treasures of Evora, Portugal offers a rich tapestry of experiences. Whether you're a wine connoisseur, a beach bum, a history enthusiast, or just an explorer at heart, Portugal has something for everyone. So pack your bags, ready your taste buds, and set your spirit of adventure free in this beautiful country. And remember, this is just a taste of what Portugal has to offer. There's a multitude of activities to enjoy in Portugal. Let's see what you can do.
In Portugal, the possibilities for adventure are endless. Picture this. You're winding through the narrow, cobblestone streets of Lisbon on a vintage tram, the city's iconic yellow cars that have been in operation for more than a century. Tram 28 in particular is a must-ride, taking you through many of the city's most popular districts, from Graça to Estrela. But Portugal's charm doesn't stop at its historic transportation. The country is a treasure trove of local markets where you can explore the vibrant produce, artisanal crafts, and culinary delights. One standout is Mercado da Ribeira, a bustling food hall in Lisbon. Here you can feast on everything from fresh seafood to traditional Portuguese pastries, all while rubbing elbows with locals. Speaking of food, don't miss out on the chance to sample regional delicacies in their place of origin. In Porto, for instance, try a francesinha, a hearty sandwich layered with various meats and topped with melted cheese and a beer-infused sauce. Or, if you're in Algarve, savor the flavors of cataplana, a seafood stew named after the copper pan it's cooked in. As you travel through Portugal, the historical neighborhoods are a sight to behold. Each has its own unique character, from the colorful, tiled buildings of Lisbon's Alfama district to the medieval charm of Porto's Ribeira. Along the way, you'll also discover a thriving street art scene with murals and graffiti that turn city walls into canvases. Take the time to stroll through these areas, immersing yourself in the local culture. Stop by a quaint cafe for a cup of strong Portuguese coffee or perhaps a glass of port wine. Take in a fado performance at a local tavern, the hauntingly beautiful music echoing through the narrow streets, a testament to Portugal's rich history and culture. And let's not forget Portugal's natural beauty. From the stunning cliffs of the Algarve to the terraced vineyards of the Douro Valley, there's plenty to explore. Whether you're hiking, biking, or simply soaking in the views, the Portuguese landscape is sure to take your breath away. After a day of exploration, it's time to unwind. Let's check out the Portuguese nightlife. When the sun sets, Portugal truly comes alive. The country's nightlife is as diverse and captivating as its daytime attractions, offering something for everyone. The capital city of Lisbon, known for its lively bar scene, is a hot spot for night owls. The Barro Alto neighborhood is a favorite among locals and tourists alike, brimming with bars, clubs, and fado houses where you can experience Portugal's soulful music. Venture north to Porto, and you'll find Rua da Galeria de Paris, a street renowned for its trendy bars and vibrant atmosphere. It's a place where you can dance the night away to the latest hits or sip on a glass of port wine while soaking in the city's energy. Portugal's nightlife is not just about partying, it's about immersing yourself in the culture, meeting new people, and making unforgettable memories. Before we wrap up, let's take a quick detour to some of Portugal's renowned museums. Portugal is a haven for art and history lovers. Indeed, the country's rich heritage is reflected in its multitude of museums, two of which we will highlight today. First, nestled in Lisbon, we find the Museo Nacional do Azulejo, or the National Tile Museum. This unique museum is dedicated solely to the preservation of decorative tiles, a significant aspect of Portuguese design and architecture. The museum's collection spans over five centuries, illustrating the evolution of tile making and its artistic significance in Portugal's cultural narrative. Next, we visit the Museo Nacional de Arte Antiga, the National Museum of Ancient Art. Housing an impressive collection of Portuguese art, the museum is a treasure trove of masterpieces from the Middle Ages to the early 19th century. It not only showcases the artistic prowess of Portuguese artists, but also provides insights into Portugal's historical timeline. We hope this journey has ignited your desire to explore Portugal. After all, each museum visit is a step back in time, a chance to relish in the country's rich tapestry of art and history. There's so much more to Portugal than we could ever cover in one video. From the mesmerizing coastline of Algarve, the enchanting history of Sintra, to the bustling, vibrant streets of Lisbon and Porto, Portugal is a treasure trove of experiences waiting to be explored. If you've been to Portugal, we'd love to hear about your favorite moments, the hidden gems you discovered, or that unforgettable plate of bacalhau you tasted. Did you find a secret spot in the Ribeira district? Or did you stumble upon a photo performance that moved you deeply? Your stories bring to life the true spirit of Portugal, and we can't wait to hear them. So go on, drop us a comment and let's keep the conversation going. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment below. Until next time, happy travels.